Yo! Where is this guy, man? 30 minutes late. Yo, 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 my bad. Hey, Dude, man. Where you know were you, bro? bro? Indian oh standard time. Hey, hey. hey. Last person here gotta eat a ghost chili pepper. Hey. Hey. Welcome everybody to another special episode of Fun Grows Food. We read the comments, you guys asked for it, we are giving it to you. It's Asian food, South Asian food, Indian, Indian food. food. So we got our Indian American singer songwriter friend Viva Swan. Namaste. Namaste. Y'all wanna check out some authentic Indian food? Let's, Let's go. Indian food, Indian food. Baby, are you down, 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 down? Indian drinks. All right, this drink right here, mango lassi. What is it, Viva Swan? I mean, it's a yogurt-based drink with a little man mango puree in there. Right, what does lassi mean? Because lassi is a famous hero dog. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I, I love the fun names, though, because we got Minta, Limta, Vimto. Thumbs, Thumbs up. up. Mm. Okay, mm. so naturally you would think that this is like the Indian Sprite. This tastes yeah. actually a little bit more like candy. The flavor like to punch you. It's either really sweet or really spicy, man. We don't know no in between. First thing you gotta eat, samosas. Samosas. Samosa. That's delicious. Those are the best samosas I've ever had. What do we got here, Viva Swan? All right, man, these are veggie pakoras right here. Pakora! Deep fried vegetables. Wait, so you Indians are Asian, but you guys don't use chopsticks. Chopsticks, nah. No. <laughs> Not the chopstick so My chopsticks right here. Yeah, a lot of Indians are vegetarian. Also think we have like the biggest selection of vegetarian cuisine too. Mm. Who, who are you calling out? For all my vegan them? hipsters. I think Ooh. you know something about this dish. <laughs> man, this is a masala dosa right here. Oh, oh, God. oh. Uh. And this dish? It's from specifically South India, where your family's from. Yeah, yeah. So how can we tell the difference? What's South Indian and what's North Indian food? Mm, I mean, South Indian food is gonna be majority coconut based, and North Indian food is gonna be majority cream based. South India, home of the dosa, palm trees all on the coast of the Indian Ocean, straight toasting, and that's why we're so damn dark. <laughs> Hey, yo, so this is naan, right? Eh, naan, naan your business. You got plain naan, this okay. is uh, wheat based or maida. And then you got uh, your roti. Uh, it's roti because it's cooked on a tawa, with T-A-W-A. Oh, it's cooked so on a tawa, yeah. yeah. Yo, so, of course, of course. <laughs> ta tawa! No, man, the tawa! The tawa! But then they make the roti. Yeah, it's uh, made out of atta, which is... Oh, atta! Atta! Uh, yeah, yeah atta! atta. You, know, you know. You can dip either one of them in this. This is uh, chicken tikka masala. And mm. this is butter chicken or chicken makani. So one has white meat in it, and one has dark meat in it. And then butter chicken is also more butter based, and this is more cream yogurt based. Mmm. That ain't no Indian buffet food. Let's make this clear. The food we're eating right now at Bandu is not buffet food. Mm -mm. Lamb biryani is the Indian fried rice. Yeah, yeah, it's basmati rice. Spice it up a little bit, fry it up a little bit. This is a coconut cur fish, fish curry. curry. Yeah. Okay. Yo, curry right. is actually kind of like a weird term. Indians just kind of use it as to mean gravy. Okay. Uh, Swan, show us on. how to eat this, yeah. man. I want it. And no spoons, no forks, man. We ain't about okay. that life. Oh, oh my word, these. Yeah. You washed uh, your hands, right? Yeah, of course. <laughs> All right, so you're gonna, you're gonna mix it up right here. Okay. And you got your five fingers. Right and here. then you're just gonna kind of, you're gonna kind of mush it. All right. Uh, and then oh. just... No, for some reason it tastes better off your fingers. Because you don't have like the hard metal spoon yeah. or fork, you just yeah. got your little fingers. Yeah, <laughs> just your food. Is this kind of the symbol for eating in India? I heard like, do you want to eat? <laughs> <laughs> in terms of like name wise, this is my favorite. <clears throat> This is called mushroom mutter. mutter. Yeah, so mushroom mutter. is mushroom mutter. and mutter means peas. Richie, what you have in your hand is called the Carolina Reaper curry. Carolina Reaper is the hottest chili in the world. Okay. Hold on, hold on. Richie's taking just a little dip. Um, Let me tell you something. I had one tip of a toothpick worth. And it's creeping all up in my mouth right now. Super hot chilies is that from North India, South India, Central? Well, this Central. is a Carolina Reaper, so I don't <laughs> think it's from. So it's from India. the South. Yeah. It's Carolina. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> The Indian representative, our man Viva Swan, you're about to try this Indian Carolina Reaper curry. All right. We're gonna see how Indian are you. Oh, <laughs> oh. this is a new show on YouTube. How Indian are you? Jello, 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 Jello. See, he's cool right now, but it'll creep up on him. I ain't no thing. <laughs> you know man, what? I, I feel I'm like scared. I ain't scared. I feel like I could do it. It ain't that bad, you know. My tongue's just about to fall off. Go for it, David first. Oh my God. You big bro. Uh, let me, you let big me, bro. Let me, let me Come on, man. Bring you me get small. Oh, you got small. You didn't even get any. Yo, Jai Ho. <laughs> Carolina Reaper. 
I feel it. Pass me the last. Go pass me. Okay, hold on. Pass me the last. Pass me the last. Ooh, it's pretty hot. It's not a. It's not a. It's there though. It's not going away. Yeah, that, that's what. That's what's spoon. wrong with it. Pass me the spoon. <laughs> that's what's wrong with it. It's not going away. It's like an Indian immigrant. It's just gonna come here and stay, man. Oh. Okay. Oh. I'm sweating a little bit. Song about how hot that is, man. Yo, these chilies are too hot. <laughs> Who can even eat a whole thing? Way too hot. Shh. Boys, boys, boys. You're overreacting. You don't even know what spicy is. Oh. Yeah. Uh, are you sure? Uh, are you sure? Uh, are you, yeah. Oh. oh. <laughs> okay, so for our last entree, we had to introduce another Indian expert from India, Preeti. Namaste! My name is Preeti. Hey, hi, I'm Preeti. Did you just say, hi, I'm pretty, I'm very pretty? <laughs> to be honest, that really sets you up for being pretty <laughs> when your parents name you. <laughs> a lot of pressure on My it. name means love. What do we got here? This is our last but a uh, very traditional mm. dish. Man, this is uh, what well, every Indian out there knows it. It's tandoori chicken. Serve it up, serve Got it the up. mini little tongs there. That's mm. cool. Mm. What do you call a hot Indian chick? <laughs> Bombay. Hey. Hey. <laughs> what's, what's up with this uh, dessert? Yeah, so this is one of the most um, popular desserts in India. It's called gulab jamun. Half ball, half syrup. Gulab jamun. With jamun. With jamun. And I hope you like a lot of jamun too. What is this? We, we got rice pudding here. What is this? This is pie some right here. Yeah, kheer. kheer. So um, it's rice pudding with rice bits inside of the rice mm. pudding. So in Slumdog Millionaire, when he's talking about lowly chai wala, he's talking about this is the chai. What time is it? Chai, chai time. time! When you guys go to Starbucks, you're getting the chai. Chai. Ah, uh, that's like BS chai. Yeah, man. this is like the oh. real stuff. You know, it's, like a, it's, that, it's that hipster BS. This is the oh. real thing. Oh, go, is, go in! My mama made it. No. My mother made this yeah. one chai, so I drink it every day. Hold up! <laughs> All right, thank you everybody for watching our Indian episode of Fung Bros Food. All right, I'm not gonna lie to you guys, prior to this, I had not had the opportunity to have a lot of authentic Indian food, but definitely I could see the influence in Burmese, Indonesian, Malaysian, Singaporean food, all over Southeast Asia, so it was dope to see the root of it, plus it was delicious too. So thank you so much for showing us your culture. Yeah, man, it was a pleasure to give you a hands-on experience. Today we had just a tip of the iceberg of the amazing cuisine of India. I encourage you out to go out there and explore our amazing country. Shout out to Banu's Indian restaurant and grocery in San Gabriel, California. Thank you for letting us shoot here. It was great food. Let us know in the comments below what you thought about it and what other foods we should try. And that's it for this episode of Fung Bros Food. Until next time, peace, peace shanti, and namaste. namaste.